Bumper to bumper traffic is a scene Mount Pleasant drivers know all too well. Traffic is a big thing in Mount Pleasant, especially recently in the last couple of years. About a year ago, the town conducted a traffic study to pinpoint where and why the bottlenecks were happening. One of the things we learned in this study is there is a four to six time um, multiplier. So for every minute that traffic is stalled, it takes four to six minutes to correct it. And a big culprit of the backups, disabled cars in the roadways. We've been seeing a lot more collisions in the roadway, um, more disabled vehicles, stuff where the roadway is being blocked and doesn't necessarily need to be blocked. But coming to the rescue are the town's new traffic response vehicles or TRVs. Its whole purpose is to clear the roadways quicker. Whether that's being able to push vehicles out of the roadway, um, you know, change tires, get you know, gas to vehicles that may have run out of gas. One of the TRV drivers is William McMullen. He says the vehicle is equipped with an array of different tools like tow straps, car jacks, gas, and a push bumper. And I got to ride inside the vehicle to check it out for myself. McMullen says there's a big sense of reward when they're able to help someone in a tough spot. So when we were able to go out there and get them out of the road and get them somewhere they can safely either call for a tow truck um, or, you know, best case, get them underway entirely. Um, that's, that's definitely always a great feeling. And something you can get involved in if you live in Mount Pleasant, the mayor says he wants to name the TRVs and he's open to suggestions. When our media partners and all put out there, there's an accident, but it sounds better if it has a name like Dolly or Fred or whatever we name it is on the scene and helping, you know, direct traffic and putting up the safety sign as opposed to just you know, Mount Pleasant uh, community service officers are on the scene. Let's give it a name. Let's personalize it because this represents our community. It keeps our people safe 